se va de casa, triste me pongo y estoy tan enamorado. Hello, my sisters. This is Shiloh Sophia, and around the rodeo of the soul, I am known as Chief Laughing Cloud. Here at Cosmic Cowgirls, all of us has another identity, a space that we get to enter into. And what's so incredible about this journey that we're about to take together is that each of you is designing and defining and divining the way to author your own future. Our work here as Cosmic Cowgirls is to invite you into an inquiry regarding your very own life to invite you to consider what is possible that you haven't been considering, to invite you to unlock the door on the heart and see what is inside of there that longs to be expressed that hasn't been expressed yet. The reason why we call this dangerous territory is because once you turn that flaming, hot, steaming red key that opens into the areas that you haven't been thinking, feeling, smelling, tasting, loving, when you go in there and you realize that there's all of this richness available to your senses, to your pleasure body, to your emotional state, to your spiritual self, your creative expression is inside of this chamber of light that lives inside of you. When you unlock that with the red key, something happens. And that something happens is that we never want to go back to the place that we were before where we weren't expressing our gifts. The entire context of the environment and tribe of Cosmic Cowgirls is an invitation to enter your interior landscape of the soul so that you can create a place and a way of being in the world that reflects who you are as an individual. There's a little white feather flying by, of course. And so what's so incredible about this happening right now is that it is something that is challenging to do our own, on our own, otherwise we might have done it by now. We get to do this as a community, as a tribe of women who have said yes to themselves and who have said, you know what, we are no longer willing to not be who we are. We are no longer willing to cut ourselves into pieces and fragment ourselves so that we don't get to express the self that is of us right inside of this life and this moment in time. From the time we were a little girl, we began to isolate and fragment. Cosmic Cowgirls is a calling back together of those pieces ourselves that we have let go. It is an invitation to begin to live in such a way that you could say, I think I'm in love with my life. And almost as important as anything else, that you could have a sense of belonging. Here at Cosmic Cowgirls, we are women with our feet on the ground, grounded, earthy, hardworking, but we're also cosmic and sparkly and feminine. We really are the women who move between the two worlds. We're the women who gather the stars and who hunker down in the dirt to meditate, to listen. We are women who are willing to open our visionary screen so that we can see that which it is that we are not seeing. We are here to turn the red key so that we can take a look at what is inside of the Muses Toolbox to invite you to have tea with us and with your muse. She's gonna want you to have tea with her. We're inviting you to pick up your magic paintbrush and sometimes your magic microphone so that you can let your poetry and your stories and your legend out of the cage. We are here to invite you to color, color pencils and paint. We are here to invite you to glitter, I hope you could see that, that was red glitter, to add the sparkle into your life in a way that has you want to wake up in the morning. You know what, this might sound like a tall order, and as I'm saying it, it is, but there is a magical element that we are experiencing over here as a community, having gathered now for quite some time, over five years, and that experience is that there is so much more pleasure play, possibility, wisdom, ideas, and connectivity available, but it takes something that we each need to commit to, and that something is called creative practice. A daily, or at least weekly, or at least whenever it occurs to you, creative practice, the journaling, the painting, 
the prayer, the dancing, the movement, and really a whole way of thinking and being and constructing your thought. I wanted to share with you a couple of the tools that we will be using, and one of them is, of course, the magical, mystical connectivity of the red thread. If you are here right now, you probably have experienced a red thread ritual with us before. So in this moment, I am extending you this red thread, which this red thread is covered in sequins. I'm extending your piece to you. And as you know, you are only responsible for the piece of the red thread that you are holding. And here, that's what we're inviting you to do. Explore the piece of the red thread that you are holding to unlock with your own red key that doorway inside the heart where your own mystic self dwells. She wants to come out. She wants to be lit up. She wants to express herself on the pages of your life. She wants you to light the flame on your own heart. She wants you to open yourself to your possibilities. She wants you to encounter that sacred space within you and never go back to the place in your life where you're no longer being who you are. We know it is not easy to be the you that you are, and that is why we need the tools, why we need to walk hand in hand, why we need to truly stick together in this journey, and why it needs to be consistent. All of you in some way are spiritual, sacred beings, whether you consider yourself practicing or not. At Cosmic Cowgirls, we welcome women from all traditions, wherever they are. But we ask everyone to join us in consistent, creative practice in the honoring of answering your call and your life path. And we will be here to back you up. And that incredible muse which calls you out of your shadow and into your light and back into the shadow and back into the light and all the while is expressing herself. We know that everybody has a story to tell, a legend to unfold, a flame to light, a heart to open, a poem to be released that song to sing, that dance to dance, that painting to paint, that symbol to explore, those friendships to deepen into, and most of all, that relationship with yourself in which you are actually excited to be you. Yes, this is possible. And yes, you are invited. And yes, the red key turns. Around here at Cosmic Cowgirls, we've had quite a whooping with the red key just to get this door wide open so that you could come in and it isn't always easy you know you're on the right track sometimes when you know that you're confronting your own beliefs your own challenges your own ways that you have kept yourself small oh, and the time is finally here the time is finally here for us to go inside into the sacred chamber of you and reveal the you that is you which is the light that lights up the whole world and from me to you and from all the Sister Cosmic Cowgirls. Welcome to the Rodeo of the Soul. Welcome to the Cosmic Cowgirl Tribe. And welcome to the opening of the Sacred Chamber of the Heart with the red key of possibility. But watch out, it's hot. <laughs> Que cuando se va de casa 